the fault finding tests uh, continue. This is the test I've put it on a bit of a platform so I can spin the wheel. Um, but the line we're looking at is this line here. Um, and these three lights should flash if the coils in the wheel are working. And we have it, all three. That's just... So our fault-finding mission is um, showing that this wheel, this motor, although it's quite old, is in actually good working order. So it's the controller. And here is the new controller that's going in. It's a 1,000 watt um, controller. Don't know if I can see that. Um, this, <laughs> that is a nightmare. <laughs> but nevertheless, this is the, the big job, I think, is digging out the old um, controller and replacing it with this one and connecting all these wires up in the right place. That'll be fun. I've had to take out the... Um, the switch that controlled the uh, restrictors, the speed restrictors. I think this may have been a, the cause of damaging the original uh, controller, so I've got to work out a different system. There we go, folks. So, wheel, okay. This device, best 10 quid I've ever spent. And um, going to test it now on the old controller, but it looks as though it's the controller that's going to be the issue. Cheers.